Hello and welcome to the 20th video podcast of the James Cotter James Gould Show with me, James Cotter. And I'm James Cord. Hello. Um, we're here on our 69th show of all time. We're coming up to our 70th later. We're going to do a celebration, James. I've got a few <laughs> few things planned, a little surprise later on. What have you got planned? Um, well, I'm not going to tell you. There's a few, it involves a ladder, tomato, razors and washing up gloves I'm and a tree. I'm going to break my arm on it. Don't worry about it. Off. Anyway, this one, we're going to talk about history. Um, we did a few video podcasts recently where we talked about Black Death, which was quite enjoyable. You yeah. had the Black Death and you had a chicken's ass, shaved chicken's ass in your yeah, face. Yeah, and a doctor going to Southampton. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's yeah. the one, yeah. yeah. Um, so I thought we'd talk about history again, and I thought we'll sort of tackle the 18th century and the 19th century. Good. Now, I've got a few facts about those centuries. And I've tackled them once. Yes, and what we're going to do is I'll tell you a few facts. I'm going to start with a few nice ones, and then we'll, we'll go into a few uh, games, okay? So... In 1815, Britain defeated Napoleon and his French armies at Waterloo. But where is Waterloo? There's a little fat question. See if you can guess, guess that. It's not in London. <laughs> really? I knew you were going to say that. I thought he was going to say this train, uh, the train station. No. But no, it's not, no. no what, where do you think it is? Um, Waterloo. Where is Waterloo? Viewers, do you know where Waterloo is? Okay, they're on Google now. <laughs> Type in Waterloo in. Type it in. Yeah, Type go on. Where yeah. is Waterloo? Um, Factual question. Oh. Get on it. Oh. It's just a guess. You've got you you got two guesses. You used that one by saying London. No, I said it was, isn't London. Yeah, but you've said it. So just just say what is it? Um. I'll put it in Surrey. I put it in Surrey. Yes. What are you putting in Surrey? What do you mean you're putting it in Surrey? No, Waterloo? Yeah. Just... In Surrey? I don't know. It's in Belgium. Oh. A lot of people, it's when that... I would ask them that, they would say France, which is an understandable answer. Yeah. Surrey is not an understandable answer. Why did you think it was in England for a start? We defeated the French. We went to the French and defeated them. Anyway, sorry. George III, we were talking about him earlier before we came out of films. Yeah. And um, that's the one you said had a tumour, okay? Yeah. So tell us about that, and I'll tell you a few facts I've got down here. They thought he was insane, and yep. thought he had a, just was insane, but he had a tumour, and it was undiagnosed, so okay. they thought that he was well, just mental. Well, George III, he died in 1820, yeah. okay? Um, did you know he was blind, okay. deaf, okay. and mad? Okay? Yeah. Any relation? Any relation to you at all? No. No? No. <laughs> I thought he would be. What? No, you're saying that you're saying that it was the tumour's fault. That he was mad, blind, deaf, stupid. Yes. Inanely stupid again, yes. like you. Um it well it would uh, I heard this tumour rumour. <laughs> tumour rumour. Um and it is I don't know if it's actually true. Because a few people have said the tumour thing, but even the hardcore tumour fans have even said that it's, he's still with blind, mad and stupid. Yeah. And deaf. Well, yeah, he was deaf, yeah. So, all right, let's... <laughs> you're, you're blind, okay? You're deaf. Okay. And you're mad. Okay? It's not a good combination. Now, I though. am your advisor. You are the king. You are King George III. Right. Okay. Now, I've just come to you with a, a query, okay? I'll say, uh, the French, they're, uh, they're revolting, King George. Yeah. How do you hear me? How do you hear me? No. How did you hear me? You're, you're deaf. No, How do you hear me? I know, but I'm just So why do you go, yeah, no, for? You just said, yeah, generally. You, said. you didn't hear me. You're deaf. Yeah, but anyway. <laughs> what do you mean, anyway? You're deaf. Yeah, I know. But I'm just saying I'm agreeing with King your George. statement. Yes. Why are you saying yes again? You didn't hear me. <laughs> you're deaf. And you can't say no, you lip rib lip rib Because lip, you can't see. Yes. Yeah, I know that. I'm just... King George. George! George! You can't see me, why are you doing that? You don't know anyone's in the room! So again, you're getting it wrong. Stop offending the blind and the deaf and the mad. Right, well, you can them, don't worry about them. No. <laughs> we don't have to be careful they around them. Comedy. Yeah, they're allowed, you're allowed to let me kill them. Anyway, alright, George. 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 <laughs> George. George! It's like a football match. George! George. Well, you're not answering. I'm trying to talk to you, King. 
Oh, okay, I'll tap you on the shoulder. I'm not going to actually let you do it because I won't touch you. Don't know where you've been. But let's say I touch oh, you. I'll right. tap you on the shoulder. Touch you on the shoulder. You're in the shower? 1820? Not in Valley. Okay, I touch you on the shoulder. Electrolux, power shower. Alright, I touch you on the shoulder. Okay. Are you responding? I'm the advisor. I'm so not going to do it. Just pretend I just did it then. Oh. Don't touch yourself on the shoulder. Alright. Could be a killer. Sorry? Could, Sorry? Oh, no, because <gasps> you don't know who's behind you. You could be killed. I don't know you're the king. You're the king. You just sat there. And you just go, could be a killer. Straight away. You don't even... What, are you on golden balls? Jasper Carrot? <laughs> could killer. be a killer, that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not the, and it takes the right ball. 10% off your... Alright, let's say it wasn't the right ball. Alright, he's touched your ball. Okay. <laughs> you're saying it's a killer. I'm alright. <laughs> it's Jasper Carrot in 1820. I'm alright. He's got a wig on. Yeah. With makeup. And he's touched your ball. Um, you're a blind man, mad, deaf, king. Sexual what are you thinking? Sex harassment. First thing you're thinking. <laughs> what are you I'm doing? Uh, no, I'm just. <laughs> All right, okay. I've uh, touched you on the shoulder and I've communicated with you somehow. Some sort of braille. I don't yeah. know. We've done it. Okay. All right. I've told you that the French are about to invade. What are you doing? You can. I've just talked to you in braille. You understood yes. it. You nodded. Yes. The French are going to invade. Touch something like you're touching Braille. Brilliant. Okay, you've touched it. You know the French have invaded. What's your thoughts? What do you mean? Hands up. You've understood it, yeah. Good, you've understood it. Yeah. But what, what's the response? Retaliate. Retaliate? Was that what you would actually physically say? That's the king. Did you say retaliate? He can talk. Oh. <laughs> he's, not, he's not mute. He can talk. Retaliate. Is that the first uh, retaliate, yeah? Yeah. All right. Because hold what? them back. Who sent... Uh, hold who back? The French? Yeah. All right, okay, so you're holding the French back. Yeah. And, um... All right, you got an, you got an army, okay? Yeah. French army, they've landed on the British coast. Yeah. Already. They, you're reading that braille, we've taken ages. They've already got here. They're on the French coast, all right? They've dug themselves in. They're all on, they're all on the coast, all right? Okay. They're about to enter your trench. Okay. Yeah. And uh, they've got something large pointing at you. What are you thinking? Jesus Christ, what is that? Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. How would you what 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 weapons would you use against the French? The same. Sorry? The same. Versailles? Not invented. No, the same. The same weapon. Well, what weapons are they using? Sorry, I've, I've sorry, I just lost track all of a sudden. I know you I'm your advisor king, but what weapons do the uh the French use? In the big stick. Big stick. Yeah. I think we've come a little bit from then, King George. What weapons did the French no, use in 1820? Just, no, just, it's a simple question. A lot of people know the answer to it. What weapons just, did the French use in 1820? They used a rifle. Rifle? Yeah. All right, okay, they used a rifle, yeah. Yeah. How large was the rifle in approximate inches? Um, Do a hand demonstration to show me how big a rifle would be. All right, it's gone out of, you've gone out of shot now, so it must be quite large. Don't make it smaller, just because the shots can't see you. All right, okay. So the rifle was that big, yeah? Yeah. How would you retaliate to a rifle that large? Um. All right, the French, all right, they've not just come, they've not just come on the channel. They haven't come on where you think they would come. No. French right near Dover. You thought, all right, they're going to come from Dover. So they've come up the rear. They've come up the rear, okay, with their large weapons. What are you doing? They've come at your ear. Scared. <laughs> you're scared? Yeah. Remember, you're mad, deaf and blind, and they're coming up your ear. What are you thinking? I screamed my head off. Okay, you're mad. They're just going to go, That's he's always doing but that. He's always doing that. You've got to get someone's attention. The French are coming at your ear. There's about 100 blokes coming at your ear. Come on, quickly, respond. It won't fit. <laughs> no, but they're coming at your ear. You're in yeah. Belgium. All right, you're in Belgium. You yeah. just got there. You escaped, yeah. all right? The French, they've surrounded you. They've encamped you, okay? You're now camp in the French camp, all right? Now, what are you going to do and how are you going to get out of this situation? Remember, you're blind, deaf and mad. Um... Quickly, you've only like got 30 in, like seconds. Like in the Battle of the Light Brigade, they got a, a turtle to... A turtle? A, yeah. What the... F um, um, what did they do with the turtle? Um, they went to, He was... Well, he was Quitly? in the fight. Oh, they wanted to... Um, he just got a turtle. <laughs> <laughs> that is the most ludicrous story I've ever heard in my life. And it, like, anyway, leave it, it, leave it. It died in 2004. Brilliant. <laughs> this has been another video podcast from the James Scott James Court Show. Um, goodbye from me, Joe Scott. Goodbye. <laughs> Turtle, what the hell are you on about?